We are here today to celebrate one of life's greatest moments and to give recognition to the worth and splendor of love. This ceremony is a tribute to your companionship and mutual respect. It is a celebration of the common ground that brought you together, as well as the strength and support that you provide for each other every day. It symbolizes your wonderful commitment to honor your differences while also merging in your most deeply held common values. What you've accomplished here today is no small feat. Your journey began way before you chose this beautiful location or even decided to spend the rest of your lives together. Your journey began the moment you first met six years ago. You took the time to learn what makes the other person smile, what makes her laugh, and how to best support him when life is less than simple. You welcomed each other's families, communities, and lifelong friends, and you joined them together with warmth and enthusiasm. You built a new village with your love and have worked every day to support this village as it changes and grows. Marriage is perhaps the greatest and most challenging adventure of human relationships. Marriages bring hard days just as they bring beautiful ones. This day is a reminder of what your love has already accomplished and the amazing possibilities of what it can continue to accomplish and overcome in the many, many years ahead. This is how love is described in 1 Corinthians. Love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, it does not dishonor others, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Gently squeeze these hands that you are holding and think about how precious they are to you. These are the hands of your best friend, young and strong and full of love for you. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together you build your future. These are the hands that will hold you, comfort you when fear or grief tries to overwhelm you. These are the hands that will help hold your family together as one. These are the hands that will tenderly hold your children. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it. And these are the hands that even after many years will provide the same unspoken tenderness with just a touch. May the Lord bless these hands and hold you in His forever. Now remember this moment in time. While this is not the beginning of your journey together through life, the words that you are about to speak will take you across a threshold and you will continue your journey united as husband and wife. Jason, do you promise to love, adore, and encourage Clara to share the good times and achievements as well as the hard times and disappointments, to keep her in sickness and in sorrow, and to be loyal to her forevermore? I do. Clara, do you promise to love, adore, and encourage Jason to share the good times and achievements as well as the hard times and disappointments, to keep him in sickness and in sorrow, and to be loyal to him forevermore? I do. Clara and Jason, do you take one another as partners from this day forward as husband and wife? We do. May these rings remind you of the enduring power of your love and strengthen you throughout life's journey. Wear them as symbols of the love that each of you carries for the other always. God of love, whose presence brings happiness to life and sweetens every relationship, we pray to thee to be present and to favor Jason and Clara that they may be truly joined in the honorable estate of marriage. As they join their hearts together, sanctify them by your spirit, and grant them full understanding of their new relationship. Enrich their lives by your grace, that they may enjoy the comforts, undergo the cares, endure the trials, and perform the duties of life together under your guidance and protection. Amen. It is with such joy that I send you out into the world to spread the beautiful light you share with those around you. By the power vested in me by the state of North Carolina, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. Still the best is yet to come